What's up guys, my name is King Goken and welcome back to my playthrough of Storm 3. Now in the previous video we got to see pretty much the same stuff that we saw in the demo. But it was still a lot of fun to play through it anyway. Uh, on this next part we'll actually be starting the uh, the 5 Kage Summit. And for this part of the playthrough I decided to cut out all of the side quests. I kind of want to just focus on the main mission. Uh, pretty much the only thing that I, that I really did cut out was just there's this one little small side quest where you have to build a birdhouse. And uh, that was pretty much it. That was it. So I, I cut out all that. I cut out all the parts where you're running around. You know, I just want to just show the mainly just the cutscenes and the fights. So hopefully you guys like that. And I'm using English dub once again. But if you guys would prefer Japanese, let me know in the comments below. Uh, all right, that's all I got to say. Enjoy the rest of the video. A hero bears longing, brings hope, even if you walk into the jaws of death, even if you're faced with crisis, let your will burn ever brighter, fight for those who believe in you. That's what a hero is. Even as days pass, and the past is replaced by the future, that name will remain as solid as rock, leaving its traces in the new age. A name is once more inherited in this world of chaos. That's what a hero is. A new wind carved into history. Its name is... <laughs> ramen, ramen! And Kakashi Sensei's buying! Couldn't be better than that! Well, you and Sakura are both working hard to help rebuild the leaf. A superior should reward his subordinates every once in a while. I wish Sai could have come too. He had an errand to run that he couldn't put off. We'll bring him next time. Hey, no worries, it's fine. I'll eat enough ramen for Sai too. Naruto, that doesn't make it fine. Whatever, this is gonna be great! Seeing you like this, no one would ever think you were the hero who saved the Hidden Leaf. Uh, don't tell me you're gonna start with that, too. Lately, I've been getting that everywhere I go, and it just makes me feel so weird. Well, you did save the village. That's a fact. People want heroes to look up to. That's just the way they are. I guess. Anyway, none of that matters. Right now, it's way more important to get to Ichiraku, ASAP! <laughs> True. Wait for me, little ramen! I swear, you're a complete ramen addict, you know that? Let's see, how many bowls should I eat today? Kakashi Sensei's paying, so the sky's the limit! There you are! Hey, I've been looking for you! Eva, what's the matter? Listen up, and just stay calm. All right, Lady Tsunade has been dismissed as Hokage. Huh? The sixth Hokage is some guy named Donzo. I don't know him, but apparently he's pretty shady. Did you say Donzo? But Donzo is Sai's boss, right? Right, and he's also the guy who plotted a conspiracy with Orochimaru. And that's not the only shocker. The 6th Hokage declared Sasuke a rogue ninja, and issued a decree permitting his disposal. He what? What do you mean? This is still just a rumor, alright? I don't know anything for sure, but it sounds like Sasuke joined up with the Akatsuki and did some damage to a hidden cloud ninja. S sasuke In the Akatsuki? Why? What's he doing there? How should I know? I don't get it either. If he's crossed a hidden cloud ninja... The Raikage won't just let it slide. 
and Sasuke's a rogue ninja to begin with. Standard operating procedure is to erase him. It was only Lady Tsunade's benevolence that was indulging us to settle this privately. I I'm gonna go talk to Donzo. I'll go too. Wait. Your barging over there won't solve anything. But if this happens, then Sasuke's... Yes, and that's why I'm telling you to wait. This is the one time you need to stay cool and collected. Donzo is expecting the both of you, particularly you, Naruto, to act rashly, in anger. If you rush in yelling, you'll be playing right into his hands. He'll have you confined here and you won't be able to do a thing. Uh, then what are we supposed to do? Just calm down. First we need to get the details. Then we can act. It won't be too late. For now, grit your teeth and calm down. Got it? Yes, we get it. So, Donzo, you've finally begun to make your move. Lord Donzo, everything's ready. Fine. My time has come. I've spent so long in the darkness, and I've finally received my chance. Sarutobi, I'll establish my ideal ninja world by my own methods. The upcoming Five Kage Summit, it must not be allowed to fail. Fu, Torene, do not forget that. Sir! We're moving out. Chapter One. The Five Kage Summit. Just calm down. First, we need to get the details. That's what Kakashi Sensei said, but. but I really. can't just. Okay. Where are you going? Captain Yamato! You were going to find Donzo, weren't you? <sighs> I won't let you. Kakashi told me all about it. He wants me to keep an eye on you. I... I have to talk to Donzo. There's something I've got to check! Now don't be selfish. Didn't Kakashi tell you to calm down? Yeah, but... I... I... I can't just stand by and watch this! And force your way through me? If you won't move, then yeah! Then no choice. If that's how you're gonna be, I'll have to restrain you by force. Let the battle begin! Captain Yamato, don't get in my way! Please! Yourself. I'm impressed. Just get out of my way! Kashi's orders are no. I'm just gonna go talk to Donzo! Why won't you let me? Because you can't just talk. Yamato, this guy sure is tough. He's a good shirt! Yamato, I'm gonna go talk to Donzo. <sighs> no normal person seriously attacks his superiors, you know. Yeah, but Captain Yamato, you... Would you look at that? I was afraid this would happen. K kakashi sensei do something about him, would you? He won't listen to a word I say. <sighs> I knew you wouldn't back down when it came to Sasuke, but... Honestly... If I don't do something, Sasuke's gonna be killed. I can't just... 
That may be true, but Donzo isn't even in the leaf anymore. He's gone to the Land of Iron for the Five Kage Summit. Five Kage Summit? The world is no longer able to let the Akatsuki run unchecked. Those who've acquired the power of the Tailed Beasts are able to threaten the larger nations. For that reason, the five Kage from each village are gathering to discuss how to deal with the Akatsuki. The trigger was an incident in the Hidden Cloud. You mean the village Kiva was just talking about? Right. I did some checking around on my own. It seems that Sasuke attacked the Cloud's Jinchuriki. That infuriated the Raikage and resulted in this summit. So Sasuke really did go over to the Akatsuki? Naruto, under these circumstances, there isn't much you can do. In that case, I'm gonna go see the Raikage, and I'm gonna convince him to forgive Sasuke! Wait a minute. Do you even know what you're saying? With the Five Kage Summit about to begin, every village is expected to curtail unnecessary missions. The fourth Hokage told me that some guy in a mask is the one pulling the Akatsuki's strings. <sighs> when I fought pain and the Nine Tails' power ran wild, the fourth Hokage appeared to me in my mind. That's when he told me the guy with the mask is behind this. He was behind the Nine Tails' mess 16 years ago, too. He was so strong, even the fourth struggled against him. I'd heard that Naruto had become the Nine Tails in that last fight. I'd wondered how he'd managed to suppress it. Of course, the fourth Hokage. Minato Sensei had a hand in it. He saved Naruto. The guy is controlling the Akatsuki. He's controlling Sasuke, too. He's just using him. So I'm gonna go see the Raikage and tell him what's really going on. Kakashi. Master Jiraiya once told me about the possibility of someone having been behind that incident 16 years ago. I could barely believe it. But the fourth Hokage actually fought him. If he says it's true, then it is. The power to control the Nine Tails and hatred for the Leaf. The only one who would have both is Madara Uchiha. When it comes to Madara, I can believe just about anything, even that he was still alive. We need to set personal feelings aside and inform Donzo of this, even if he's gone to the summit. Understood. I'll take care of it. I'll send word immediately. Kakashi-sensei, I... Naruto, what else did the fourth Hokage say to you? Uh... Fathers tend to have a lot they want to tell their sons. He told me... he believed in me. Good. Naruto, you go to the Raikage. Yamato and I will tag along, as your escorts. What? Why exactly? Naruto, continue on the path that the Fourth believed in. I'll help you do that. Give the Raikage your best shot. Yes, sir! I'm freezing. I wish he'd hurry up and come back. Uh, uh, sh shut up, Suigetsu. Just shut up and hold still. You haven't exactly been holding still yourself, you know, Karin. Th th this is different. I'm a. I've got time to kill, so I'm exercising, that's all. Exercising, huh? <laughs> <laughs> He... he's really taking his time, isn't he? Oh, don't tell me he went back without us. I doubt it. I don't think it would be to his advantage to leave us here. 
still, you don't often see a guy that weird looking. Maybe we shouldn't have gone with him so easily, huh, Sasuke? The Five Kage Summit? That's right. The Five Kage are gathering for a meeting in the Land of Iron. And? What good is that information to me? Danzo. One of the participants was part of the group that set up Itachi, your brother. <coughs> Although he seems to be calling himself the Sixth Hokage now. Danzo. <laughs> Sasuke, if you are headed for the Land of Iron, I'll lend you a guide. Zetsu. Hmm? Show Sasuke to the Five Kage Summit. Sure thing. <laughs> Looks like he's back. Hey there, sorry about that. Was I a bit late? Uh, a bit? My butt! We practically froze to death out here, you moron! Ah, so you were cold. Say what?! And? How was it? I'd expect no less from the venue of the Five Kage Summit. Their guard was pretty tight. Huh? What are you saying? Does that mean we won't be able to infiltrate? No. There are always holes, even in the sturdiest wall. Follow me. I'll take you to the back door. Let's go. <sighs> the land of iron sure is cold, isn't it? The Raikage's gonna be here, right? Right. It won't be much farther now. Let's go. Yes, sir! Darui. Yeah. Show yourselves! We know you're there! These guys, they're from the Leaf. And Boss, the guy with the mask, that's Kakashi Hatake. Hmm. <laughs> I know that much. Tell me, are you aware that the Five Kage Summit is about to begin? We knew that, yes. Today we have come to ask a favor, sir. A favor? Sasuke! Sasuke Uchiha! I want you to cancel his disposal! You what? What are you- I know it's a lot to ask, but I have to try! Sasuke's my best friend! I can't just sit back and watch him be killed! And I don't want him to become the cause of war between the Leaf and Cloud! I don't want either of us to get caught up in revenge! I'm begging you! I don't want anyone else getting killed for revenge! Huh. And here I was wondering what you'd ask. Why should I stop Sasuke's disposal? As far as this world is concerned, he's trash! <laughs> what he did brought chaos to the cloud. That chaos is about to spread around the world. Sasuke's very existence is evil. He no longer counts as a ninja. Evil can't be allowed to have its way. All we're doing is getting rid of something the world does not need. You have no right to stop us. Sasuke... isn't trash. Naruto. And he is needed! He's not evil! You have to understand. He's my friend. He's important to me! Hmm. <laughs> you say he's important to you? Then you're quite a fool yourself. I don't care what you say about me! But... don't talk bad about Sasuke! You don't know how this world works. Nothing you say will change a thing. This world does not need Sasuke Uchiha. And he is an evil that will throw it into confusion. <laughs> My lord... Don't interfere. A brat like that couldn't even give me a warm-up. Naruto, calm down. I won't forgive you! <laughs> Let the battle begin! You're going to regret making the fist from the right cargo. 
fight with me when you weren't strong enough to follow through? That wasn't even a warm-up. That's the right Kage for you. He was completely holding back. And even so... Did you think swinging your fists around would make everything go your way? That's pure idiocy, plain and simple. Nothing but the delusion of a brat who has no idea how the world works. Think more deeply about what it is you ought to do now. The ninja world is not so indulgent as to suffer fools. That's enough. <clears throat> Lord Raikage, allow me to apologize for all these incivilities. As his superior, they are my responsibility. I will accept any penalty you mete out. <laughs> he was energetic and faced me without fear. As a reward for that, just this once, I'll turn a blind eye. Lord Raikage has been lenient. Accept his decision and go in peace. We thank you for your consideration. Darn it! Whew. What is it? Oh, that guy. I was thinking about what he was going to do next. Daroi, you'd do better to think about the summit right now. If anything happens, there'll be trouble. Yeah, I know that, still. Kakashi, what should we do next? Let's see. Your petition didn't go through, and you haven't yet decided what to do. In that case, why not listen to my story? <laughs> You're... you're Akatsuki? I don't believe we've met in person before, have we? That mask... The fourth Hokage told me that some guy in a mask is the one pulling the Akatsuki strings. So you're the one pulling the Akatsuki strings. You're Madara Uchiha. Well, well. So you know that much already, do you? I'm rather surprised. The fourth Hokage told me! He said you were the worst of the worst! The fourth Hokage, Minato Namikaze. Madara, I thought the first Hokage defeated you long, long ago. You thought wrong. As you can see, I lived. I stand before you now. Can't be. And what do you want with Naruto, Madara? Do you think you can steal the Nine Tails all by yourself? <laughs> I have no intention of doing that at this time. I merely came to talk with Naruto Uzumaki. Talk? What is this thing that caused pain Nagato to betray me? Naruto, you've sparked my interest. I don't care about what you want! Tell me about Sasuke! He's in the Akatsuki now, right? Sasuke, huh? True, he is in the care of the Akatsuki right now. And he's doing what I want him to. So you tricked Sasuke! Maybe. Why, you... <laughs> Wanna go? Perfect. It's a good chance to see for myself the power that defeated pain. Come now, show me. Let's see what the hero of the leaf can really do. 
Let the battle begin! Naruto Uzumaki the hero! Watch that! I'm gonna take you down! Huh? We don't know what sort of power he means. Don't let your guard down! I know that! I can go at any time. Mother of Chief, who'd have believed you were still alive? It's an honor to be able to fight you like this, Kakashi. I see. It looks like you've got more power than I thought. What is this guy? Is he holding back? I'm empty. Ah! Well done, Kakashi. I'll protect you. Keep going, Yamato. Try to back. I won't let you go. Goodbye. I won't let you go. Oh, well, well. You're pushing me quite hard. Anyway, Naruto, focus. Goodbye, Naruto. I'll protect you. Goodbye, you well, Naruto. Go away. I hear My new jutsu will flatten even the thickest wall. Game over! This guy, it's like he's just playing. I see. Yes, I mustn't underestimate you. Give back Sasuke! Howl for Sasuke all you want, but he'll never return to the leaf. What? Sasuke has learned the truth about Itachi. Now that he knows, he'll never turn to the light. What are you talking about? Oh, that's right. If we're going to talk about Sasuke, first, I'll have to tell you the truth about Itachi. Truth? About Itachi? Listen, I speak of a man who loved his brother and the leaf more than anyone, even as he drew the Leaf's hatred. I'll tell you the truth about Itachi Uchiha. Five Kage assemble here today in response to Lord Raikage's summons. I, Mifune, shall preside over it. Now let the Five Kage summit commence. Hmm. There is no time. First, I will tell you why I called you here. Hmm? I've summoned you here to finally question your loyalties. This is very sudden, Raikage. Loyalties? Aren't you exaggerating a bit? You're shameless, Tsuchikage. You're the most suspicious of all! What you say? Leaf, stone, sand, mist. The Akatsuki is composed of rogue ninja from your villages. And that's not all. I have proof that there are those among you who have even utilized the Akatsuki. <laughs> utilized? What do you mean by utilized? You're Kazekage, and you know nothing? You, San, have previously used the Akatsuki. Currently, all five great nations are equally stable and are switching over from arms buildup to disarmament. Of course, there are risks that come with that. If a war breaks out suddenly, who will fight? So one way to avoid that risk is having a mercenary force, such as the Akatsuki handy. Is that it? They go into battle for a very low price, and they've achieved excellent results. Don't go high and mighty on me. What is it, Lady Mizukage? Since it's come to this, I will be honest. 
There is concern as to whether someone may have been manipulating my predecessor, the fourth Mizukage. It could have been one of the Akatsuki, but I didn't want to make a big deal out of it. Your village too? You disgust me, each and every one of you. Before you start arguing each other's merits, there's something I would like to tell everyone. What is it? The Akatsuki's leader is probably Madara Uchiha. What? I don't understand it all myself, but this is from a pretty reliable source. I thought he was long dead. So, he really is a monster, huh? Let me say this as the leader of this neutral state. It's a rare thing indeed for all five Kage to convene in one place. So how think you? Until the Akatsuki can be disposed of, why not form the world's first allied ninja force? Allied forces? A splendid proposition. We are practically in a state of emergency. Cooperation is key. That would be acceptable. However, to whom do you propose handing the reins of these allied forces? If the choice were left solely to you all, you would squabble. Thus, I would like to make this suggestion. The only remaining Jinchuriki is the Leaf's Nine Tails, and I feel that how he is guided will be the key. Also, considering that working with differing personalities, ages, and nations would be necessary, I think the best choice would be this. Why not allow the Hidden Leaf Village's Hokage to lead the Ninja Alliance forces? What? That's a lie! You're making that up! No. No way. It's not falsehood. That is the truth about Itachi. He died for Sasuke and for the Leaf. <laughs> it doesn't make sense. If what you say is true and Sasuke knows it, why doesn't he come back to the Leaf? <laughs> As Sasuke's teacher, you assume you know his true feelings, but you couldn't be more in the dark. He's the real thing. A true Avenger. But... I don't get it. Why? Why would he... How did it turn into this much of a mess? Why did he choose revenge? It couldn't be helped. It is the blood-soaked Uchiha destiny of hate. A curse of hatred that began with the father of Ninja, the Sage of the Six Paths. Hatred? Curse? Once upon a time, the Sage of the Six Paths had two children. They trained together, and grew up together, but they had two different attitudes toward peace. The older son knew strength was necessary for peace. The younger son knew love was necessary for peace. When the Sage of the Six Paths finally named a successor, he chose the younger son, who sought love. Enraged, the older one declared war on his brother. Their descendants continued the battle, even as time marched on. The older brother's descendants came to be known as the Uchiha, the younger brothers, the Senju. Senju? You mean, the clan of the first Hokage? That's right. I have met Hashirama Senju, the first Hokage, in battle many, many times. Naruto Uzumaki. I can tell that you hold Senju's will of fire within you. Senju and Uchiha. Will of fire and hatred. Naruto and Sasuke. You are just the next in line to be chosen by destiny. 
Sasuke has shouldered the entire burden of Uchiha hatred and plans to ram that curse of hatred deep into the world. That hate is his strongest weapon, his friend, and the true source of his power. That is Sasuke's ninja way. <laughs> you will probably end up fighting Sasuke again one day. Or rather, I'll throw Sasuke at you. This long, predestined battle, I will have Sasuke prove his heritage as an Uchiha. Sasuke is not your toy! Quit talking nonsense! If your goal really is that foolish proof, then why collect the tailed beasts? What's your true objective? Well, if I were forced to choose, it would probably be to become a complete form. What do you mean? Telling you now would be somewhat meaningless. I'll tell you under more fitting circumstances. It was fun chatting with you folks. Later. <laughs> Kakashi. Why? Why would you give supreme authority over the Ninja Alliance to him? This man is also known by the moniker, the Ninja of Darkness. I am merely stating my unbiased opinion as a neutral party. If it's acceptable, then I will take this mission. Don't make me laugh! Nobody said you were- Just a moment, please. Lord Hokage, please show us that right eye that you keep swathed in bandages. Ow, what's this about? What does Lord Hokage's bandaged eye have to do with anything? Something about the way things were going felt off, so I took the liberty of using my Byakugan on the Lord Hokage. What I saw when I did so was something I had fought long ago, the shotting gun of Shisui Uchiha. Shisui's particular visual jutsu induced phantom experiences, which seemed like voluntary acts. Hokage, don't tell me you're manipulating the Fune to turn the situation to your advantage! Even if you fool the others, you cannot trick my Byakugan. Lord Hokage! Hmm. You? Well, hello there! Sasuke Uchiha has invaded this place. I wonder where he could be. Time to find Sasuke. Come on! What? Sasuke? What's he doing here? Let the game begin. I wonder who'll get to meet him first. And the moth flies into the flame. Darui, see! Sir, we're going to avenge B. Come! This summit could get interesting. Ow, we would like you to confirm whether the Hokage's visual jutsu is still engaged or not, please. It's not. Right now, even his chakra network is quiet. The jutsu is undone. Lord Hokage, you have lost trust. A shame, since I may have still chosen you without your resorting to such tactics. But may have is not good enough. I shall do whatever it takes to protect the ninja world. You'll never unite the world through discussion. Morals and ethics will affect no change at all. But it takes time to actualize an ideal. Even if you think it's all right, in the end you'll just breed distrust, ill feelings and hatred. Look, Danzo, right now we cannot even trust what you say. Whether you trust me or not, results are necessary. If that's the state of the world, and of humanity, we have no future. If we stop trying to understand and trust each other, all that will remain is fear and terror. Strategy that does not incorporate morality and giving up are things that I no longer accept easily. Such deep thoughts. But you're still just a green brat who knows nothing about running a village. 
So now's your chance to ask anything you'd like. As your senior, I'm willing to answer any question you have. Eh, Danzo? <laughs> Say that again! Then let me ask you this. Sure. Go ahead. No holds barred, kid. When did you all forsake yourselves? Huh? <laughs> now, Gara, what should we do? We cooperated with the Leaf on their Sasuke retrieval operation, but he's now descended to joining the Akatsuki. Sasuke Uchiha, huh? 